أعوذ بالله من الشيطان الرجيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم In the name of Allah, the most beneficent and the most merciful. This is our virtual learning system session 2020 Pakistan International School Taif. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuhu. Welcome to our online class. How are you children? I am your teacher Imrana Khurshid. This is the Islamic study subject for the students of class two. How are you boys and girls? Hope you all are fine. We are doing Islamic belief unit one and this is our the lesson number three about angels. Let's uh, take a look of the previous lesson. We have done the reading and explanation in lecture number four. Let's revise before doing the exercises. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says that we all have to believe in the six pillars of our Iman. Number one was in lesson two. It's about to believe in Allah. This is the second pillar of our Iman is to believe in the angels of Allah. Angels, children, are very important creation of Allah that if we don't believe that angels are not creation of Allah, then we are not considered as a Muslim because for a Muslim, these four pillars are very important to believe in them. This chapter is about the nature and qualities of angels. That if we believe in angels, we believe we have to know uh, about them, how Allah created them and what are their jobs. Let's start the reading. A Muslim believes in angels he should know that Allah created angels before he created Adam a.s. They are made of light. We are made of clay children. Adam a.s. is made of clay. But his creation of Allah, the angels are created by light. So as the light travels very fast, they travel at the speed of light. We do not see them. Can you see any angel? No. But they can see all of us. They note all the activities which we do during the day. And there is one angel who write our good deeds and the other one who write our bad deeds. And they are making the record of each and everything. What, what are the other qualities of angels? They do not eat or drink. They do not sleep. They are neither male or female. This is a very different creation of Allah. We don't say them that they are boys and girls, they are female or female. And they have no desires or need like us. They don't wish anything. They don't want anything. They always praise Allah. What is their duty? Only to praise Allah. They always serve Allah. Serve Allah means they obey all the orders and they do their jobs. They carry out Allah's order. If Allah asks them to do any, anything, they do directly. They don't say no to anything. They never disobey Allah. Let's start the exercise and question and answer of this chapter. Open your book, page number 18. This is your page number 18, children. First, we will do the question and answers. And you have to note down all the question and answers on your notebook as the homework. And you have also, please learn along with the spellings. 
the fill in the blanks and true false exercise number two and three i have given you the task in the previous lesson that do it by yourself today we will review the exercise number two and three inshallah let's start the question answers ready children this is question number one when were the angels created when were the angels created children angels were created before creation of adam Salam. it means before the creation of human beings adam Salam is the father of all human beings allah created adam Salam. And Allah asked the angels to go down to do sajda before Adam alayhi salam. Angels were worried that Allah is creating the um, man and they would cause harm in, on the earth. But when Allah gave knowledge to Adam alayhi salam, they all accepted happily and followed the order of Allah and they go down before Adam salam. Question number one. I hope you have done it. Let's do question number two. What are angels made of? What are angels made of? Angels are made of light. As I told you children, they are made of light. It is called Noor. The light is made by Allah and it travels very, very fast. You can understand by this example that Allah orders Jibreel alayhi salam and gives the ayat of Quran as wahi to, to deliver to Muhammad sallallahu alayhi salam and he comes so fast to Muhammad sallallahu alayhi salam at very high speed and delivered the message and they can go anywhere they can't change their personalities by the order of Allah. They can appear as a man also and they travel very fast. And now I read the question again. What are angels made of? Angels are made of light. I hope you understand this. Question number three. What do angels do? What is their job, children? What they do? Angels, their job is to always praise and serve Allah. To always say, Alhamdulillah, Subhanallah, Allah Akbar. They always do the speak and they always serve Allah. They obey all the order. Angels praise Allah non-stop. Praising Allah is their job, is their duty, and is their nature. They don't worship Allah for the short time or they get tired. No, they praise Allah non-stop. Let's do question number four. Does a Muslim believe in angels? Yes. The answer is a Muslim believes in angels. Because if we don't believe in angels, we are far from the right path. Because it is a part of our Iman to believe in angels. Children, angels always make dua for good people, for the believers, especially for the people who offer salah and who do good ibadah, especially for the kids, for the people who get knowledge of deen 
and who recite and learn the Quran, who gives the Quran by heart. So, does a Muslim, what is question number four, does a Muslim believe in angels? Yes. The answer is a Muslim believes in angels. The last question is, what is that angels never do? Which thing they don't do, children? The answer is angels never disobey Allah. All the time they say yes to Allah, all the orders they do happily. They don't say no to Allah for anything. Angels never disobey Allah. Hope you all have done this, all these question answers. We have five question answers in this chapter. Children, I told you, you have to note down them on your notebook. Let's do the exercise number two along with me. I hope you have already done it, but let's take a look and recheck your exercise. This is mark true or false. Number one, the angels are female. Are they female? Are they girls or women? No, they are not female and not male. So this statement is wrong, false. Number two, they always praise Allah. Yes, this is correct, right, true. Angels are made of fire, no children. Angels are made of light. Which creation or creation of Allah is made of fire? It is jinn. Jinn are made of fire. The human beings are made of clay. And the angels are made of light. Number four. They always carry out Allah's order. Yes, this is correct. They always obey Allah. And the last one is, they always sleep. No, they don't sleep. They don't eat. They don't drink. They don't need anything. So it is false. I repeat, children. Number one, the angels are female. They always praise Allah. True. The number one, the angels are female, is false. They always praise Allah true. Angels are made of fire, false. They always carry out Allah's order true. They always sleep, false. I hope you all have done correctly. If not, please do it with me now. Let's do the next exercise. Exercise number three, it is fill in the blanks. Let's start. Angels are made of, what is the answer children? What are the angels made of? Light, correct. Please note down on your book. Number two, they do not blank. What will you write here? They do not sleep. What is the spelling of light? L-I-G-H-T. And what is the spelling of sleep? S-L-E-E-P. -E Good. Let's do number three. Angels were created before creation of, yes, Adam alayhi salam. Check the spelling of Adam alayhi salam, A-D-A-M. A-S means alayhi salam. We do not see angels, but they can, what will you write in the blank? See, they can see us, S-E-E-C. -E the last one is, they always blank Allah, they always serve or praise. You can also write praise, P-R-A-I-S-E, and you can also write serve, S-E-R-V-E. You can also write obey, O-B-E-Y. Anything you can write here, they always serve Allah, they always obey Allah, they always praise Allah. 
Hope you all have done this. Let's take a review. Angels are made of light. They do not sleep. Angels were created before creation of Adam alayhi salam. We do not see angels, but they can see us. They always serve Allah. Alhamdulillah, we have done this all. Your homework children, learn and write all question and answers on your notebook. Don't forget to mention the unit number and the date along with the lesson and write in very good handwriting. Thank you very much for being with me. Hope you enjoyed your lesson and hope you get enough knowledge about the angels. This is the safety tips which I told you in the previous lesson. Please try to stay in home. But if it is necessary, you can go only for these important things. The first one is to buy grocery. Children, if you want to go for grocery, please stay at the distance when you are paying the bill. And if, uh, God forbid, if you are sick, may Allah bless you good health, you can also visit the doctor. And it is important to have any kind of exercise at home. But if it is important to go for a walk or anything, please uh, take a distance at least six feet apart and take care of your loved ones, take care of yourself and go out only for the very important and essential job. Stay blessed, goodbye, and take care. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.